a ray of hope is don't be afraid just believe because when they come here mm -hmm. they tend to not know what next okay. so you just have to believe that everything is going to be all right this is just one of the many written inspirational quotes decorating the walls around Ivan Towson's home 26 years ago Yvonne, the owner of a friend in need charity, decided to turn her personal space into a shelter. Through the charity, she offers meals to the mentally challenged and a home to the homeless. Pass all your care on the Lord. She's a former police officer quitting the force years ago to become a full time caregiver. I remember going to the court and uh, the judge asked uh, a little boy, I said to the judge, your Honor, if you send me home, I'm going to kill myself, and I volunteer to take that child. And from that time, the judge has asked, Miss Townsend, can you take another? And that another becomes 112 to date. Those she shelter range in age from a few weeks old to adults. But how does she do it without having a steady income? We have a thrift shop. And persons will donate material items and from these we sell at a minimal cost ranges from fifty dollars up so what is being sold for today that money goes to buy the food for tomorrow one day at a time and trust me it has been good because little is much when god is in it even also caters to abused women and hiv victims just recently she gave shelter to a mother of twins the woman was on the verge of giving her children away. Immediately, we heard of the situation. We went by the institution and we, 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 instead of taking the twins, we took everybody because we believe in family. Her work has borne fruit. Some of the young people she helped are now doctors, teachers and pastors. She wants to do more but is in need of assistance. We want food items, we want clothing. You know, we're not asking for cash necessarily if you don't have. However, our greatest need right now is a motor vehicle to take the children to school, to church. You know, they, they, we have young children here who, you know, sick in the night and we have to wait until in the morning. We could rush them to the hospital, but the, you know, we have vehicular constraints. So please, everybody help, one one cocoa full basket. With a ray of hope, I'm Ken Morgan.